Sarah G. and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome back. If you've been here before, I really appreciate you joining me again today. Today I have a special video. I have a video on a bag that is quite popular bag, but I have not seen any videos yet on YouTube with this color uh, of the bag. So I'm really excited to share it with you. I've had it for a little while, so I've worn it a bit and I am loving it more and more every time I wear it. And that bag is by Saint Laurent. Here it is in its dust bag. You keep it stored in its dust bag. And it is the Saint Laurent Lulu bag in the medium size. And this is in the navy with the silver hardware on it. Isn't that stunning? So originally I wanted this bag in black with the silver hardware and that's what I went into the store to buy. And when I went into the store, the sales associate showed me quite a few colors in the bag. The bag comes in a lot of different colors and they do have seasonal colors. I think this is one of the seasonal colors. And he showed me this and I was stunned. I thought this navy blue is just such a gorgeous blue color. I love the look of the navy with the silver hardware. You can get it, I think, with the gold hardware. I didn't see one in store with the gold hardware, I don't think, with the navy. But they do make gold hardware, so um, I guess it's possible to get the navy with the gold hardware, but I got the silver, and I love how squishy this bag is. I knew that I would love this bag, but the color is really what, um, what was a surprise to me. I was not expecting to go into the store and to come home with a navy blue bag. I knew I wanted a black one, and um, I, <laughs> I would say that going into a store and you know you've been thinking about an item for several months you're stalking it on youtube you're watching videos on it and then to go into the store and end up buying something you know different than what you had planned on buying is a little scary but i absolutely am happy with my decision i don't regret it at all i think it's beautiful so let me give you um a little tour of the bag so it does have these two these two leather brakes in this strap they say saint laurent paris on both of them they're they're pretty comfortable i kind of wish maybe that they were a little padded kind of like the bag is padded um i think that would be kind of cool but they're still pretty comfortable i'm so happy that it does not all chain all the way um and then it's just a single flat bag the front of it has a magnetic closure the magnetic closure is amazing on this bag i think you ask anyone who has this bag they'll tell you that this magnetic closure on the front the snap is really strong and uh, i feel really safe with that um so just one little snap here now this is the stuffing that the bag came with and whenever i'm not using it i just put the same stuffing back in it uh, so let me take the stuffing out for you so you can see the inside of the bag it came stuffed really well i was really impressed so the inside of the flap is just a plain flap oh you can see my my finger marks on it um silver and then in the back of the of the purse you see it says saint laurent paris so the structure of the bag is it has three compartments this uh flap compartment here a middle compartment with a zipper and then the back compartment and then the back compartment also has another zip here in the back i don't really use the back compartment too much um what's in here is just still the authenticity card still in the wrapping um oh i lied there's a pen there's a pen in there so um what i'm loving more and more about this bag the more i use it is that the leather seems to be more squishy and I just maybe have gone over the hurdle of, of being nervous about scratching it and damaging it. Oh, let me show you the bottom. It doesn't have any feet at the bottom, which is fine, I think. Um, this bag is kind of, it's, it's so casual and fluffy that maybe feet would have made it more sturdy and I like that the bag is kind of squishy. Um, so let me show you a couple things that go, that I carry with me on a daily basis on pretty much all of my bags. And let me show you how it fits. So the first thing that I carry in most of my bags is the Louis Vuitton cosmetics case. This is in the PM size. Um, this is the smallest size they make in the cosmetic case and it's in the Damier Ben. This fits in here, which I think is amazing. This is the medium size Lulu. I usually put it in the back compartment here. And it's a little snug 
kind of getting it in this top part but once it goes down this is a little wider at the bottom and because the cosmetic case is a little wider at the bottom it fits perfectly down in the bottom of the bag so i carry this with me and i usually put that in the bottom of the bag there what i also always carry with me these are my ray-ban sunglasses i usually put those in this side just standing up on the back side of the bag then i carry with me this wallet this is the current wallet i'm carrying right now it's um an older Louis Vuitton wallet. I'm trying to think of the name. I don't remember the name of it right now, but it's double-sided. It opens up um, like this with a money slot at the top. And then on the other side, the side with the metal button, it opens and it's just um, kind of like a card compartment. I don't keep changing and I keep extra cards. Um, I'll put the name of this wallet down below in the description box or somewhere along the screen right here. So my wallet, I put in the front compartment, which is pretty, you know, pretty wide. You can fit a lot in there. Then I have right now, Mac Essential. I usually put my mask in the center zip compartment because that's really the only thing that goes in there and I know exactly where it is and I just leave that open. Then I also always carry with me a charger. So this is my iPhone charger and i usually stick this in the back section just on top of everything in the back and then my most recent purchase is my louis vuitton mini pochette accessories in the damier Ben. now normally well i don't know normally because i just got this but what i plan on doing is carrying either this or the cosmetics pouch depending on what bag i'm carrying but just to show you today right now i'm gonna put it just in the front of the bag and you'll see that it fits fine right in here i'm gonna put it up put it standing up and that fits that fits fine in there then also necessary hand sanitizer that's gonna go just in the front of the bag a hair tie in front of the bag and i still have plenty of room got it snapped it's not bulky at all you see there's lots of extra room here at the bottom at the top of the bag let me show you if i can get you a good angle so there's still some space right here you could put um a key holder you could put um maybe reading glasses you could put a card case easily in there you could you could definitely fit in a uh, a few extra items in there. You hear that snap? Oh my gosh, amazing. So this is my Saint Laurent Lulu in the medium size in the navy blue color with silver hardware. I love this bag. I am so happy that I got it. Uh, this is my first piece from Saint Laurent and I am extremely impressed with the leather so far. It smells delicious. It wears pretty well. It, I was a little nervous with it in the beginning because I didn't want to scratch it up, but I've been using it. I, I bought this bag, I believe January of this year or early February of this year. So it hasn't been too long. It's only July right now, but I have used it quite a bit and I'm loving it so far. I would highly recommend this bag, whether you want to get it in this color or in, you know, whatever other color they offer, they offer lots of different colors, but I would highly recommend the bag. So if you guys have any questions for me in regards to the bag or you're thinking of getting one, place a comment down below. Again, my name is Sarah Jean. Thank you so much for joining the video today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'm new and I'm starting to post some more videos, so I'd love to have you back. Bye everyone. Have a great day.